Hello everyone, welcome back to Learn English with Susan. So today we're going to talk about parts of speech. Nah, untuk kali ini kita akan membahas tentang parts of speech, di mana parts of speech ini adalah bagian penting untuk kalian yang mau lancar berbahasa Inggris atau lancar menulis dalam bahasa Inggris. Namun, yang belum subscribe, jangan lupa untuk di subscribe. So, let's get started. Here, we have eight parts of speech. Noun, verb, adjective, pronoun, preposition, adverb, conjunction, and interjection. Noun. Noun artinya kata benda. Biasanya noun itu digunakan untuk nama tempat, place, person, idea, or even things. Example words. Contoh katanya. Teacher. Jakarta. Table. Cat. For examples of the sentence. I live in Jakarta. The second one, verb. Verb itu adalah kata kerja, di mana verb ini describes action or even experience. Example words, contoh katanya, sing, talk, realize, sit, stand, read. Example sentence. I read a funny story. The next one. Adjective. Adjective itu adalah kata sifat. An adjective describes noun. Example words. Good. Big. Small. Bad. Beautiful. Smart. Example sentence. She is good. In English. Pronoun. Pronoun ini adalah kata ganti. Pronoun replaces the name of person, place, thing. Example words. She, he, they, we, him, her, this, that, and etc. For the example sentence. Susan is Indonesian. She is pretty. Preposition atau kata depan. Preposition links a noun to another word. Example words. In, on, above, to, eight, and many more. Example sentence. She goes to school on Monday. Adverb. Adverb atau kata keterangan. Adverb describes a verb, adjective, or adverb. Example words. Quickly. Silently. Well. Badly. Very. Really. And etc. Example sentence. He eats quickly. Conjunction. Conjunction ini adalah kata hubung. Conjunction joins clauses or sentences or words. Example words. But, and, because, yet, since, or, and etc. Example sentence. I like pizza and spaghetti. And the last one. Interjection. Interjection adalah kata seru. Short exclamations sometimes inserted into a sentence atau biasanya digunakan untuk mengekspresikan emosi, ya. Example words-nya, ouch. Oh. Aha. Hooray. Wow. Example sentence, ouch. That's hurt. 
Okay, so here we go. Great job. You have learned eight parts of speech. Hopefully, through this video, you will understand part of speech and you can use it in your daily conversation or to write something. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Happy learning!